it's a beautiful sight, but yet wildlife biologists or so-called ecology experts or biologists hate these. I'm sure, pretty sure you guys know what this is, a, a low head dam right here. We're right, I'm right below Riverside Drive near the Helena Street, you know, bridge right here. This is probably one of the more beautiful low head dams we have and no, they have not yet began to commence on um, demolishing the one on Monument Avenue. It was supposed to begin this month, but I think due to the high water, it might have been pushed back a little bit, but this is probably one of the most, you know, beautiful ones in the entire city. It's a beautiful sight to behold, and as far as I know, this one is not yet on the list to demolish, but given our local park system and these biologists and all this other fluff crap, I would not be surprised if they eventually get to this one in the next five or ten years. There's a unique bird, white bird. Might be a seagull, I'm not sure, but... And you hear these biologists say all kinds of stuff like it's bad for wildlife, but yet the birds from there seem to enjoy it. And uh, it's a beautiful sight to behold. And you know, opinions are mixed on these, you know, depending on who you listen to or how much of a knowledgeable opinion you have. You know, some people like these as good fishing streams because they say it helps the fish and other wildlife. So, you know, see just the beauty of the water moving, but yet they want to destroy this. Listen to that beautiful sound of rushing water. It's beautiful, but yet they want to eradicate these. They claim part of the reason is all the industries that once depended on these no longer exist and all this other stuff. You know, take that for what it's worth. You know, a beautiful view of it from the top part. So I want to make this video because eventually they're bound to determine almost everywhere in the U.S. it seems to destroy these. So I want this to be a little bit of a historical record so people can at least remember at one point in time what these look like at one point in time. Simply stunning. It's a beautiful sight to behold. And I really wish they would start leaving these things alone. Because they really don't need to bother these. The reasons that they give, you know say it all oh, it'll make uh, it will make for safer kayaking and boating but they claim it improves you know the fish habitat which there's a lot of fishermen who strongly disagree with that so you know it's time that we fight to at least keep some of these around because they're not despicable or anything they are a beautiful sight to behold. But as I said, wildlife biologists and park people really 
seem to hate these. These beautiful sights of nature. So just, you know, cherish this because eventually they're going to try and get rid of all of these that they can. But anyway, YouTube, that's it for this one.